I hope you've jumped in. The water is fine. I hope you've taken the plunge. I hope you've committed to the Major Gifts Challenge. Over two dozen videos in this series develop the steps of raising major gifts, challenging you to jump in and start raising major gifts for your organization. The videos cover the process from start to finish. If you're unsure what the challenge is, check out the introductory video here and get yourself up to speed. If you missed any of the blogs, you can always go back and review. The weekly action steps of the Major Gifts Challenge have you well on your way to raising major gifts. You might have already raised a few. If you've followed the steps but haven't raised any major gifts this year, relax, take a breath. The Major Gift Challenge is designed to help you start and sustain a major gift program. There are lots of variables, so it may take a little longer for one organization than another. Consistency is what's important. Stay with the process and you'll have a productive major gift program. Remember, the steps to raising major gifts are time consuming. One challenge video dealt with time management and offered ways to fit major gift fundraising into a busy development office schedule. The most important takeaway of the major gifts challenge, and this might surprise you, comes down to this. Raising major gifts doesn't have to be hard. The hardest part is setting aside time and doing something every week to move the needle. That's why I created the Major Gifts Challenge, to teach you manageable steps to accomplish a monumental achievement. Unfortunately, raising major gifts has no deadlines. It's easy not to find time for it when your gala rolls around or something else comes along, especially if you think it's a hard task with little chance of success. But I know something you don't. It's another surprising takeaway about raising major gifts. Here it is. Anyone can raise major gifts. You can raise major gifts. I know that you can do this beyond a shadow of a doubt. I've seen hundreds of fundraisers who started as novices raising four, five, and even six figure gifts for the very first time. You have learned their formula for success in this series. Success in raising major gifts comes in part from knowing the path, but it's even more important to walk the path consistently. You can raise major gifts. Raising those huge game-changing gifts for your organization comes from the perfect union of know-how and commitment. The Major Gifts Challenge has provided you with lots of know-how, but the commitment, that's up to you. So if you're still not there yet, go back to the beginning. It may be just one or two steps that need to be repeated to open the door to Major Gifts. Here's a link to the very first post. Hundreds of people enthusiastically pledged, I'm in. Were you one of them? Did you follow through? If not, why not? What got in the way of your success? This week's action item gives you the chance to give something back to me as the creator of the Major Gifts Challenge. And then I've got something more for you. This task is super simple. It'll take you just a couple of minutes. Take two to three minutes to share one success and one obstacle you faced during the Major Gifts Challenge. Successes need not be securing a gift. Small successes count too, like getting more meetings with donors, or seeing more engagement on the part of your board members. Write a comment below to share your one success and one challenge. Please include your full name in step two. 
I'll review all comments over the course of the next week. Then I'll randomly select three winners for a free 45-minute private coaching call with me. I'll list winners in my email newsletter next week. So if you don't already get my weekly emails, sign up here. If you want more information on all things related to raising major gifts, check out my seven-week online course, Mastering Major Gifts. Worth 35 CFRE credits, the course covers more detail than the Major Gifts Challenge, offering dozens of templates and worksheets so you save time and avoid reinventing the wheel. Learn more here. Now it's your turn to share your progress with the Major Gifts Challenge. Did you see the Challenge Yourself action item? Share one success and one challenge, and you'll be entered to win a free coaching call with me. What are you waiting for? Share your comments below. Congratulations, you're on your way to mastering major gifts. If you want more videos like this, head on over to amyeisenstein.com. There you can subscribe to my weekly newsletter and when you do, you'll get instant access to two free eBooks. Like and share. The larger the conversation, the more we all learn. Thanks again for taking the Major Gifts Challenge. Working together, we will make the world a better place.